Uh, this one I started in last year, but uh, I just decided I'm finished with it. I did a little bit touching up on it over uh, the last couple of weeks. Uh, the last video I did on it was pretty much how it is, but I want to talk a little bit about it. And uh, I took some kind of brighter pictures you can see that might show it off a little better. Uh, I had a lot of fun making the kind of like the zombie ones I did in Halloween. And um, I, I was going to do some more of those. But I, I, that's about all I, I only got like four or five of them done before I, I didn't catch up with the painting, so I kind of tore that setup down with the lighting, but uh, I probably might do that again sometime. Uh, but these are a lot of fun, and uh, you can see here in the, the picture how I kind of went in a crazy painting scheme, almost like as if it's under black lights, and uh, that's what I really want to do is, um, if I get a black light or something, maybe this will like one in a, a socket like a lamp maybe that might, that might be enough for just take some pictures but I think it looked really cool and glow a lot because um, they put the white different pink streaks along his arms and everything and I was a little nervous about painting it this way at first because I thought it didn't look very real but but it has a good effect to sitting on the, the table it really kind of stands out I think um, and he's a, uh, I don't know what is, if he has a number or anything, but his name is uh, Mashup Mike is what they call him. Uh, I don't, I don't know who he's supposed to be, like, modeled after, because a lot of the Slug Zombies are kind of spoofs on popular characters, but I never really understood who this guy was supposed to be. Kind of looked like the guy from uh, Ninja Turtles that, I forget who had the mohawk, is he Rocksteady or Bebop? Uh... I always get them confused when they're in like their human form, but uh, probably Bebop. I guess he has a mohawk still. But uh, it's kind of cool figure. It's fun painting the chain around his neck. He's got like this big skull thing, and I don't know. I had a lot of fun with it. Well, we can't now though. I kind of wish I. He kind of looks like he has a beard, but I didn't really paint him with a beard. It just kind of ended up that way in the the photo, but. Uh, these are a lot of fun. I, I've had a lot more fun, I think, painting these slug zombies and the muscle figures because I can... Because I, I don't know, it just seems... Because they're newer, maybe. Because I, I, maybe I'm nervous painting the old toys in some way. But these ones I can have a lot of fun with. And uh, I like how they, they turned out. So, But uh, here's some new pictures. And uh, I'll put links below to the gallery. And if I could find the other previous before photos I'll put them on here too but uh, thanks for watching and uh, check back to do some more of these uh, wrap-up videos when I get some more projects finished <laughs>